Okay. What's going on? I'm uh, putting some casters, just these casters, five inch casters onto this um, assembly table. This is a Rockler um, Rocksteady work table or assembly tables that they have. You can kind of put together. I got the one where I can do a flip top, flip top thing, make it go from 28 by 56 to 56 by 56. But I did not get the uh, Rockler wheels because I forgot. So I just ordered these off from, you know, good old Amazon. We're going to put these on because I want these to be mobile around the uh, shop. Kind of a uh, update here. Yeah. On the uh, shop, we're getting closer to getting closer to start making some actual furniture. I need things to be mobile. You know, everybody, everybody likes things to be mobile <laughs> in a small shop because you don't have a lot of room. I've got about a, um, I think I'm about 22, 22 or 23 feet wide here by about 27 or 28 feet in length. Not bad, not great. Every woodworker would like their shop to be a bit bigger. I'm no different. Having things on mobile bases and casters is pretty important. So do you guys know that uh, <laughs> Fleetwood Mac I was listening to an interview with uh, Stevie Nicks. She's talking about that song, You Can Go Your Own Way. She literally hates that song. There's a line in it. Uh, Shacking up's all you want to do. Pisses her right off. <laughs> to no end. She doesn't like singing it. She kind of thought that um, her and Lindsey Buckingham, the writer of that song, they had a pretty tumultuous relationship, right? Uh, on again, off again. Uh, love interest for a lot of years and a lot of uh, music is you know written from a lot of emotion but she thought that they were in a uh, pretty legitimate relationship so shacking up wasn't that wasn't what she thought she was doing so that song just really irritates her that's my Fleetwood Mac trivia and uh, on this channel if you guys decide to follow subscribe like whatever um, you know I'm gonna mix some of that stuff in because I just love I love hearing that old those old um, stories about how some of those songs came together. So let's keep doing this. All right, this side is done. I know I mentioned it, but kind of an uh, entry level partner for Rockler. So they did send me these Rockler Rocksteady bases to try out. I didn't pay for these, but this also is not sponsored by Rockler. They didn't pay me at all. So I'm going to give these kind of a test. As of right now, I really like them. Probably um, we'll end up throwing some some black like laminate on top of these so I can get it like kind of a slick surface that glue easily cleans up on and I'll show you that. I think it'll look nice and it'll make a better smoother surface. So we'll do that in a later video, but long story short, I'll let you guys know how I think these perform. That kind of goes for a few other tools in here. I am a partner of Harvey Tools, Harvey Woodworking. I do have a table saw. And I do have um, a dust collector uh, unit, the G700, that I'm going to be uh, giving um, some updates on and reviews on the table saw. I did make some cuts on it for the very first time. Pretty happy with it. It's a four horsepower unit. So far, dust collection looks pretty good. I didn't set up the overarm dust collection, which it does come with. I do plan on doing that. Um, so there's some features on there that I like better than my old Delta Unisaw, which I had for about 20 plus years. More powerful. Uh, I think it's going to be a nice addition uh, to this shop. So let's do the little speed up thing and get going through this. Also, if you're following me for somebody that's polished and professional at YouTube, you'll be sorely disappointed because I am not polished. I don't pretend to know everything that I'm doing about everything. I'll just tell you that whatever I show is pretty honest and true to what I'm doing. Let's see how she rolls. I think she's gonna roll pretty good. Like I said, this um, rock steady table is gonna be pretty nice. This, these casters lock and everything. Feel pretty steady. I'm just gonna shove these kind of back here for right now. This is kind of what we're, where we're at. I will uh, 
check back in with you guys on the next video. Tune in, subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. Okay, until next time, that was cheesy.